This is Eddie Colon, EC Details, back with another episode. Today, we're gonna do our two month review of the ceramic coatings, Will It Survive? This will be the last time for one of these coatings. Make your own conclusions. So, oh, the car itself is gnarly, the car itself is dirty. It's time to put it to work. I wanna show you the hydrophobics after I wash the car. Now, we're gonna go through how we're gonna wash it today. Um, we have a couple options, you know? Keep my options open because I'm a free agent. We got Foam Party, MV Snow, uh, Rock, Paper, Scissors. What'd you say, Jamie? MV Snow. And then we're going to use our new, almost favorite uh, foam can in the Bear Force. Link in the description below. Wait, did he just plug? He did! Because I do get credit for that. It is Amazon. Guys, listen. It's like five cents, okay? I get five cents credit. If you don't want to buy from me, fine. Don't buy from me. This foam can here, busted. Um, we're gonna go over the hydrophobics of the car. We're gonna see how it's doing after the initial contact wash. And then uh, we'll go from there. Which option you want on the panel that died, you'll see when it's, you know which panel it is, but we'll see. You know, you'll see after I do the video which panel gave up the ghosts. Hallelujah. Uh, the new HPC 2.0. I have half a bottle left. It should still be good. I kept the room temp, not crystallizing. We have a new bottle of DIY that, uh, we got there, we got the easy peasy lemon squeezy from Ethos. Tell me which one you want in the comments below and I'll put it to this panel that gave up the ghost and went to, you know, coding heaven. Um, I'm excited for this test. It has been snowing, it has been raining, it has been sleeting, it has been snowing. We got like 18 inches, then it melted. Then we got another 10 inches, then it melted. It's been gnarly. The winter here has been gross, disgusting. It's been ridiculous. We've been hit with salt, sand, all that jazz. So this test is gonna really push these coatings um, beyond the limit, I believe. Uh, I'm excited to show you, no more talking, let's get to work. All right, we're gonna take NV Snow. This is not their plus. This is their pH neutral soap. We're gonna pour it and I'm gonna do about two ounces here. We're gonna pour that there. I like the consistency of the soap because it's not too, it's not too thick. Take our bare force. Look, look how thick that is, dude. So it wasn't just foam party. Stick. Look at that soap is thick. It's only two ounces of snow. Um, with a kind of a the situation we're in now, where this is like caked on. I personally would use the decon soap. I didn't want to use it. I'm trying to keep it pH neutral so no one says, well, uh, the heat console took the others, not this. So I'll do a contact wash. If that doesn't clean it, I'll wash it again. But let me show you the panel. So you can see right here that it is pulling down. It's breaking up that dirt right there. And it is pulling it down here. So we're going to give it one more minute and then we'll spray it off. Watch this part. So look at this part. So this is Cerakote. I topped that with something to save that life because I was testing something here. So that was that finish line that we put on here in that last video. So remember, I didn't touch the doors with any other product when I did my last video. So you can see this because this would need a decon wash, but for the sake of video, I'm gonna keep it kosher. Panel right here, I did this panel right here. With with finish line, and you can just tell us that's their uh, that was the test I was doing. 
This is nasty, y'all. Look at that. What a beast. Look at nasty, y'all. Good lord. Look at ADS. You can see ADS is doing all right. He's beating the water. There's a spot right here that is a little flat. No contact watch. This is stoner. You can see there's still grime on here, but stoner is a sheeting water. It's a little flat in the bottom corner here. Envy fan. But Envy Snow does not clean as good as Foam Party. I have to test it against Shampoo Plus, but Foam Party seemed to do better at a pre-wash. That's what it was made for. This one left a little bit to be desired. We're gonna do this real quick. I'm gonna foam the doors. We're gonna do a contact wash. So I was doing a little test here, and this is what is left on the panel just by wiping it with a pre-wash for NB Snow. Like I said, not my favorite. Not, it was, it didn't do good, didn't do good. Compared to the newer stuff that's out, they really need to change the formula. This is not an NV review, I'm just being honest. NV Snow, I've used you for years, but I'm feeling like your soap's kind of weak, bro. So, I'll foam this on, and we'll do a contact wash. Look, look at the dirt. Flip it over. In this instance, I would definitely use a two bucket method because that's gonna scratch the crap out of your paint. That's where we're at with this. This is the ADS side. Same thing, look at the dirt. Flip that over. Snow doesn't really cut the dirt like other pH neutral soaps. More disappointing in soap than Cerakote. But let's look at the panel. Let's see what it does after the contact wash. This is Cerakote. If you find her, let me know. But she gone. Look, she gone. She is out of here. If you find her, tell her she left her coat at home. Cause she gone. Out. Nowhere to be found. She's as flat as my. <laughs> Next panel. There we go, Kronos. Now look at Kronos. The top is hydrophobic. The bottom is hydrophobic. We're weak. We are weak from there to there. And yeah. Without a topper, holding on, hold on, doing good. So far, um, Kronos is doing way, way better than the coating that's not on the side of the car. There are some parts that's gonna need a little bit of work, but if I was doing a decon wash, which I should have done, I'm just doing this to show you that these are taking hits, right? They're not clogged. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna show you something. I'll show you something in a minute, watch this. ADS. ADS, look at that, see, look at that, look. that part came back, look at that, look at that, so this, yep, look, yeah, ADS is a winner, dude, right here, donor, Look at that. It went to fast sheeting, still holding on strong. I think at this moment, Stonus is doing better than Kronos on the lower panels, but it's flooding, so it might be Kronos. So it's flooding right there. But look how good that looks. Look. Yeah, I would buy that. I, I would buy Stoners, I would. Um, it's doing real good. Um, is it as chemical resistant as 
ADS, no. ADS is a little more stout. You see it come back, all the beading came back. Stoners has some parts that are a little weak, but if I use like a water spot remover, which I will not, I will not. Maybe my next wash. I just did a decon wash like three weeks ago or a month ago. So right now, I'm gonna give you the heads up. ADS number one, uh, I'm gonna give Kronos number two, Stoners number three, and my other coating left the race. It's no longer there, it's gone. She out, gone. Gone, like she ran down, I can't find her. Let's just be honest, okay, let's keep it real. Uh, Sarah coat, yeah, you didn't make it. She left, she divorced my car. I don't know what happened, I thought we were having a good, she out. Envy Snow as a pH neutral soap does not clean as good as other pH neutral soap. So if you want one that does it all, uh, I would get Foam Party, I would get uh, Incredible Suds, Snow Shampoo Plus, uh, GSF cleans better than it. I'm kind of disappointed. Uh, just a tiny bit. It's still great soap. Still great soap. Reset cleans better than it. Uh, but today was the first day because I've been using so much soap lately. And I'm like, good lord, this is not, it's not up to par, kid. You know, it's a brand new bottle. Uh, but with that said, ADS is the first winner. Uh, ADS is keeping it strong. Has not lost any of its hydrophobics properties. Uh, it came back just with a bucket wash. Uh, Kronos Sonar's both took a minor hit. Stoner's more than Kronos, but to both seven years and not last three months, like strong, there's a problem. Like, you know, you're like, Eddie, you could use a water spot remover to clean it up. But yes, but three months, three months, I washed it every week. I washed the car every week with pH neutral soap. With that said, since ADS is coming on top, since ADS decided to come play in the playground, right, and bring everybody a treat, we're gonna do a giveaway. I'm gonna give away for lower 48, because look, I, I don't think they'll ship to Canada but I have this in stock. I'm gonna give away a Armor Pro coating. Now, you get this, you put it on your car, that's between you and God. Do not complain to Brad, do not complain to DJ. It is a little harder to put, but that coating is stout. All you have to do to enter is hit ADS, hashtag ADS in the comment, hashtag ADS in the comment. I will be doing this live on the Keep It Real podcast this Thursday. Um, and then just thank you for watching. Now, if you haven't hit the subscribe button, hook a brother up, hit the subscribe. Help me, help me out, okay? Everything I use today will be in the description below. They are Amazon links. They help me buy some uh, Rice Krispie Treats. Look at my body. Gotta keep my fat lips going, you know what I'm saying? Hook up with that. Anyway, EC Details, thank you for coming into our two-month update. I'm out, and I'm gone.